Hi everybody, it's Ab Fab. Welcome to my new makeup, lifestyle, chit chat, uh, crazy comedy mm, channel. Hope you're all having a really great uh, Sunday. Hope you had a really fun and safe Halloween. Um, my husband and I, we didn't do anything. We just stayed at home and we handed out candy and waited for all the crazy kids to come by and there was like, 20. So it was pretty. But anyways, hope you guys had a really fun Halloween. Uh, as you can see, I'm drinking the drink of Canadians, Tim Hortons coffee. Delish. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Always have to have my coffee. Anyways, welcome to my channel. I am shooting a uh, first time on my laptop, so even though it feels like I'm staring down at you and the lighting is kind of weird, um, I hope you'll find it a little bit better than some of the crazy videos, music videos I did with my iPad as that was a bit awkward. Anyways, welcome. Um, I just wanted to, uh, first of all, uh, talk about a product that I'm wearing on my lips, which I bought at Sephora, um, went on the website, didn't see it on the website. I'm not sure if I was actually looking for it on the website, but anyways, love to go into Sephora and walk up and down the aisles and see what's available. Anyways, and I found this, and I absolutely love it, um, but I don't really have huge expectations for lip pencils. Anyways, that's what we're talking about, is lip pencils. So I'm just going to grab it here. It's just off screen. I went to Sephora, and this is a Sephora brand uh, that I totally recommend. I think it's really great value, and it was the Sephora Kissing Stories 8 Jumbo Glossy Lip Pencils right here. So there's all the eight of them. Anyways, I just wanted to talk about them because they were around $35. That's how much I paid for it. It comes in the great kit. There is a cover to it and it's kind of nice. It says kissing stories and it's got little, it's iridescent, sort of opaque and it's got, you know, snowflakes and, um, and then you open it up and you've got these great pencils inside these jumbo pencils. So we all know that jumbo pencils are really big or it seems like they're really big this year. And I just wanted to talk a little bit about the actual pencils and the beautiful formulation because it's so smooth when you put it on, so silky. It's so luxurious feeling. Um, the only con, if there is a con, is that they're not long lasting. They're more sheer kind of coverage. They'd be beautiful over intensifying uh, some of your favorite lipsticks, but let's be real. There's eight colors here. So honestly, if you don't like any of the colors they've given you, you could do a numerous amount of custom blends to make just the perfect color for you. So anyways, I'd start off with the number one pencil. That's what it is. This is what it looks like. And this one is in the color copper. So you can see the corresponding sort of copper top. And then when you take the lid off, that's what they look like. And you can see that they have kind of little iridescent sort of sheen to them. They're all glossy. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm just going to color swatch that for you. And I hope that the lighting is not too bad. So you can kind of see that's a very light sort of copper. I don't know if you quite get the actual sort of gloss on there the little sort of iridescent qualities about it. But like I said, if you buy these, I don't think you'll be disappointed. They're not supposed to be matte, long lasting wear, you know, eight, 10, 12 hour lipsticks. These are just fun Christmas or fall lipsticks um, that you would reapply. So anyways, that first color was um, copper. And the second color here on the actual list is, what's this called? It's called Soft Rose. So this is Soft Rose. There's the corresponding color. I'll just swatch that out for you there. That's what it looks like there. That's the Soft Rose, really beautiful. And they do have actually a very, very light uh, fragrance. So they kind of smell like strawberries and all of them are the same. It's not just the soft pink smells like strawberries. They all smell like strawberries. So if you really don't mild, mind a sort of mild strawberry smell, then you will totally love these. 
Okay, number three on the list, and this one is called light pink. So you can see correspondingly, it's got a light pink top. This is super, super gloss, like very, 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 very light. So I'll swatch that out for you there. That is the soft pink. So yeah, you get a better look at the iridescent qualities there. That's like super, super, super light. So that would be a really great one for putting on top of your favorite lipstick and kind of jazzing it up. Okay, and the next one, this one's called Apricot, and it kind of does look like Apricot, so I'll swatch that out for you there. So that's that one. This one's really quite nice, actually, and I'm not really big on Apricot, but that's the Apricot color right there. All right, the next one in line, this one is called Candy Pink. Totally looks like Candy Pink. I'll put that one at the bottom here. Ooh, actually, that's a really beautiful color there. So that's candy pink there. Totally gorgeous. Actually, really, really, really like that. And you can see, again, that iridescent sort of quality to them, which is kind of nice. And remember, anything that kind of draws light appears forward, bigger. That's your lips. Got it? This one here, this is number six on the list, and this one is neon pink. Neon pink, very, very neon. We'll swatch that just below. You can see that one right there. So that's kind of nice. Just um, a different shade from the other one. Okay, and then number seven on that list, this is called Peony. That's what it looks like. I'll swatch it on the side. Peony, hmm, quite nice actually. So there's Peony right there. Ooh, quite pigmented. That one is really good. Definitely don't need an additional base on that. And last but not least is the nice red. Perfect for fall and Christmas time and all the parties coming up. And that one goes on. Oh, and they're so, they're so smooth. The, the formulation, honestly, it's so gorgeous. There's the red. And what I like about this red is for fair-skinned gals like myself. And if you're fair-haired and fair-skinned with blue eyes out there, you'll really appreciate the blue-reds. So that's really good. So anyways, that's the Kissing Stories Jumbo Glossy Lip Pencils, and that's Sephora Zone. So I found that to be of really great value. So um, I don't know if they have a lot more kits, hopefully. And I picked those up about two weeks ago. So hopefully if you, um, if you think that that's something that you would like, uh, I would say that it's worth the $35. Those are all the colors once again, so you can kind of see those, kind of the iridescent qualities. And again, with the eight, if there's not one specific color that you like, you have eight colors to custom blend something that's totally unique and different for you. So that'll be really, really good. And then the other product I got was uh, everybody's been using these cleansing cloths. And I just, you know, I have a, a foam cleanser at nighttime that I take my makeup off with. And then um, I have Marcel, uh, which is, uh, I pick it up at Shoppers, and I use that to take my eye makeup off. But anyways, I kind of thought I'm going to try some of the cleaning cloths and see if they're any good. You know, they seem to be reasonably expensive. This one was $20. This is by Oli Dirksen. Uh, oh, sorry, Oli Hendrickson. And this was one, they've got quite a few. They've got exfoliating, they've got one with lavender. This is the orange package, and it's infused with vitamin C and CoQ, uh, Co, <laughs> CoQ10 enzymes. So it's kind of nice, and I just opened it up. Let me just peel off this little sticker that's inside there and then you've got your cost I think uh, you get 25 for $19 so not that great a deal but anyways I've used it a few times because I've been practicing and swatching these colors these lip pencils so that's the actual cloth really really big and it's got a very very um, sort of orangey smell if you're not really big into fragrances probably is not going to be your cloth but um, I like the idea that it's infused with vitamin C and the CoQ, uh, CoQ10 enzymes. Can't even speak today. So if that's something that you think that you would like, it's kind of nice because after you take all your makeup off, your face is still infused with the vitamin C. So I'm just going to try it on my swatched hand and just kind of see how that takes it all away. And keep in mind, this cloth that I just opened, it's been sitting on the sideboard for like, 10 minutes and it's still got quite a lot of product on it. 
So let's see here if I can get rid of the red one. <laughs> so I don't know. I think it did a pretty good job. Clean. One cloth. Still lots of product. And uh, the lip pencils, I've got the uh, soft pink one on my lips now. And um, I just love it. Yeah. So, like I said, not long lasting wear. I think I get about uh, two and a half, three hours out of them if I don't eat or drink uh, before reapplying. But I wasn't expecting uh, like a huge long wearing lipstick. Um, and for eight to be $35 and for me to have the option to custom blend, I just think that that's like an awesome deal. So anyways, I hope you like the products that we talked about today. So that was the Vitamin C Ole Hendrickson's uh, Cleansing Makeup uh, Cloths or Removers. And then of course the, um, the Jumbo Glossy uh, Lip Pencils that Sephora has out called the Kissing Stories for Christmas. Anyways, I'm going to finish drinking my Tim Hortons coffee and I hope you are all out there and you put your feet up for this Sunday evening and uh, you're just relaxing and chilling before you got to go to work on Monday like myself and I hope you all have a ab fab evening and if you like this channel please subscribe and leave your comments and questions of things that you might want to see covered. And uh, let me know what you think about my, my beachy waves hair, if you like it or not. I don't know if you've seen the other videos. All right, everybody, take care. Hope you have a really, really great evening. Bye.